Hello everyone, today is Dimash reaction and analysis video. Why do I like reaction and analysis video this much? One, because it gives you and it gives my students and all the potential singers out there a real time, you know, experience of how good singers apply this and how to begin to see themselves applying it when they sing. That's probably one of the most important reason. And then the more we watch you know these singers sing, especially our favorite singers, the more we take something from them, especially if we're desirous to sing, if we're desiring to sing, you find out that you're picking out some skills from them and beginning to sound a little more like them gradually. So today we have Dimash. I'm not really sure anybody can really sound like this guy, honestly, because he's just in a world of his own. You see what I mean? Let's go. What did he do to his voice here? Probably because this is <clears throat> playing from maybe a CD or iTunes or something. It's already gone through the process, the studio process, yeah. And they worked on it a little bit. Can you hear how really deep and clean it sounds in terms of clarity is being EQ'd? And so on, um, but he sounds really deep. That's quite, quite deep. Okay, you know what? I won't call what, where he started from chest voice because that's deeper than his chest voice. If this is my chest voice and you hear me sing like this, wait in a ball in a ball it I'll probably need a register called Vocal Fry to get there. That's not my chest voice, it's below my chest voice. So um, he's using basically all his range when he sings. He has lots of choices to make. Um, lots of, um, how will I put it, um, weapons in his vocals to choose from. And that's why he's so good. Okay, now in the last video I did a reaction and analysis of him, somebody mentioned that he's been through a lot and I'm, I'm sure he's talking about challenges, but that's where the person stopped and I'm like, I thought he got the support from his parents and he grew up, you no. Know, peacefully learning and developing in his singing and music uh, I don't know I, I'm not sure I know about any challenges he passed through as a, a younger person so um, I, I'll be delighted if anyone knows if any of you know please let me know what he went through because these are the things that make champions these are the things that mold someone to great greatness yeah so put in the comment section, what challenge did Dimash go through when he was younger? The voice he's using right now, I won't call it mixed voice. It's not really that, uh, not present. Present is not the word. It's not really that piercing like a um, mixed voice per se, but it's between mixed voice and um, um, head voice. Yeah, yeah. Wow, 
Now, that sounds so good. At first, the head voice he was doing, oh, it sounded so good that I almost was trying to figure out if it's a flute or if it's a human voice. But from maybe th uh, five seconds into it, I found out that it was actually his voice because of the way it moved. Yeah. But it sounded so good. It sounded like a musical instrument. And that's what he has here. Cool. So if you're looking for mixed voice, he just did it. That is proper mixed voice. What a handsome young man. He has it all, all the gift, the talents. He's just incredible. He's just amazing. Well, I've done this blizzard. I think I've had it um, for a while in my list and now it's come up. So there you are, the Marsh Blizzard. I really enjoyed it and I hope you did too. See you in the next reaction and analysis video. Bye.